Hello, welcome to Joyous Daughter of God. My name is Amy and today it is October 3rd, 2020 and we are on day three of one Proverbs a day. So if you all are able to, go ahead, grab your Bibles and turn to Proverbs chapter three and I will open up in a prayer. Father God, I come before you in the mighty name of your son, Jesus Christ. And Lord, I just thank you for another day that you have blessed us with. I thank you for your mercies and your love that you have bestowed upon us this day. And Lord, I just ask that you bless this video and may this video be pleasing unto you. And I thank you for another opportunity to read your word and to share your word. And Lord, I thank you for another time of fellowship that I can come together with the brethren and whoever you bring across this channel, Lord. Lord, I just pray, open up our hearts and our ears to hear your word and what you have for us. And Lord, I just pray, open up our mind and Holy Spirit, teach us and show us new revelations that you want us to gain from Proverbs 3 that we never seen before. Or just a great reminder that we just need to take hold of and truly believe. And Lord, I just ask, still our minds, allow our minds to be at peace so we can really focus on your word, and that is me included. Remove all distractions away from us, Lord, and allow them not to hinder this video from going forth. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. So you guys may hear kids um, playing in the background. I'm at a park, so that is why all right if you all would just go ahead and turn to Proverbs chapter 3 guidance for the young my son do not forget my law but let your heart keep my commands for length of days and long life and peace they will add to you let not mercy and truth forsake you bind them around your neck Write them on the tablet of your heart, and so find favor and high esteem in the sight of God and man. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. For in all your ways acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your paths. Do not be wise in your own eyes. Fear the Lord, and depart from evil. It will be health to your flesh and strength to your bones. Honor the Lord with your possessions and with the first fruits of all your increase. So your barns will be filled with plenty and your vats will overflow with new wine. My son, do not despise the chastening of the Lord, nor detest his correction. For whom the Lord loves, he corrects, just as a father, the son in whom he delights. Happy is the man who finds wisdom, and the man who gains understanding. For her proceeds are better than silver. Wait, for her proceeds are better than the profits of silver, and her gain than fine gold. She is more precious than rubies. And all the things you may desire cannot compare with her. Length of days is in her right hand, and her left hand riches in honor. Her ways are ways of pleasantness, and all her paths are peace. She is a tree of life to those who take hold of her. And happy are all who retain her. The Lord by wisdom founded the earth, by understanding, he established the heavens. By his knowledge, the depths were broken up, and clouds dropped down the dew. My son, let them not depart from your eyes. Keep sound wisdom and discretion, so they will be life to your soul and grace to your neck. Then you will walk safely in your way, and your foot will not stumble. When you lie down, you will not be afraid. Yes, you will lie down and your sleep will be sweet. 
Do not be afraid of sudden terror, nor of trouble from the wicked when it comes. For the Lord will be your confidence and will keep your foot from being caught. Do not withhold good from those to whom it is due, when it is in the power of your hand to do so. Do not say to your neighbor, go and come back, and tomorrow I will give it, when you have it with you. Do not devise evil against your neighbor, for he dwells by you for safety's sake. Do not strive with a man without cause, if he has done you no harm. Do not envy the oppressor and choose none of his ways. For the perverse person is an abomination to the Lord, but his secret counsel is with the upright. The curse of the Lord is on the house of the wicked, but he blesses the home of the just. Surely he scorns the scornful, but gives grace to the humble. The wise shall inherit glory but shame shall be the legacy of fools wow that is um i would say proverbs chapter three is a one two punch powerhouse um chapter of the book and just a passage in the bible that's very powerful for us to really truly take in and take heed to I mean, I almost could read it over again, but I won't, you know, do that. However, let's, um, let's remember this. I'll reread one through seven, and then I'll break it down again, and you all I, maybe the deer will come. I'm keeping the camera like this right now, but I see a deer. Hold on. Let me just go ahead and put it over there. See if y'all can see it. I don't know if y'all can see it. I don't want to zoom in because I feel like it messed up my... Or it didn't. But maybe if I keep the camera... Maybe they'll come eventually. I'll just hold it. <laughs> okay. And so my son, do not forget my law, but let your heart keep my commands. So let us keep the commands of our Father God, the ones that even Jesus Christ instructed us to keep because you know everything that Jesus said he pointed it to, towards the father and it's what you know the father gave him to say so allow us to remember the commands and the words that the Lord gives us and allow us to honor them for length of days and long life and peace they will add to you so you see, they will give us peace. Let not mercy and truth forsake you. Bind them around your neck. So look, not only do we put on the belt of truth, we bind God's truth around our neck and we carry it with us wherever we go. Write them on the tablet of your heart. Again, keeping them on the tablet of our heart to where we will remember them where they will come back into remembrance why is that doing that okay and now let's go down to Okay, verse 4. And so find favor and high esteem in the sight of God and man. So allow us to find favor and high esteem in the sight of who first? God. Let's always remember to find 
high esteem and God first and then it shall follow with man okay trust in the Lord I'm just gonna put my camera back down it keeps I don't know what it's doing trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding in all your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your paths so again let us trust in the Lord with all our heart not some of it not a little bit of it but all our heart and lean not on our own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him so in all our ways allow us to acknowledge God and he shall direct your paths he shall direct our paths he will guide us do not be wise in your own eyes fear the Lord and depart from evil and let's go down to 11 and 12 and to remember this my son do not despise the chastening of the Lord nor detest his correction for whom the Lord loves he corrects just as a father the son in whom he delights so see the lord don't um get all discouraged or anything if the lord is chastising you and correcting you because the lord corrects those that he loves and why it's because he does not want to see us erring in any way shape or form he wants us to be on the right path. Oh, and um, I'll do 13 to 18. I mean, there's so much more. I would suggest you all just go back and read Proverbs 3 for yourselves as well. But wisdom, 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 wisdom is so important. Happy is the man who finds wisdom and the man who gains understanding. For her proceeds are better than the profits of silver and her gain than fine gold. She is more precious than rubies and all the things you may desire cannot compare with her. Length of days is in her right hand and her left hand riches and honor. Her ways are ways of pleasantness and all her paths are peace she is a tree of life to those who take hold of her and look at that isn't it amazing we got a tree right there in front of her but wisdom wisdom is a tree of life to those who take hold of her and happy are all who retain her okay let me do 19 and through 22 I'm sorry it's just so good the Lord by wisdom founded the earth by understanding he established the heavens by his knowledge the depths were broken up and clouds dropped down the dew my son let them not depart from your eyes keep sound wisdom and discretion so they will be life to your soul and grace to your neck and I'm just going to go ahead and stop there because like I said, I probably should have went ahead and did it. But I could have just read um, chapter 3 all over again. Well, I just want to thank you all for tuning in to Joyous Daughter of God. And I just pray that even if you don't listen to this all the way through, that it just encourages you to go and read it, you know, the Bible on your own, wherever the Lord is leading y'all to. Um, just go and read and be edified in His truth. Father God, I come before you in the mighty name of your Son, Jesus, and just thank you so much for your powerful word. Lord, I thank you that you are such a good, good Father. And Lord, I thank you 
for the animals that you have put before me with the deer and I just hope that the people who watch this not only get your word but they get a piece of nature if they could see them and Lord thank you just thank you for your glory thank you for your word thank you for your truth thank you for your love and your mercy I just praise your wonderful glorious name oh Lord God thank you so much for everything in the mighty name of Jesus I pray amen I don't know if you guys can see it I'm not going to my camera's being silly hold on let me there it is maybe it'll I don't know the deer is right there and I don't know if it's coming in my sorry I'm trying to cleanse my lens if y'all can see it or not it's right there in front of the bush but it's kind of hidden so I'm going to go ahead and get off of here before it won't upload but maybe it'll show up in the the video I don't know I oh here it comes I'll just be quiet well it was coming and let me move over here maybe y'all will see it can y'all see it there they are All right, I'm going to stop here. <laughs>